I'm walking on water. Just like. <laughs> like who? Like a pond skater. Who are you thinking? <laughs> no matter. I suppose you thought nothing else in life could surprise you, eh? Wrong. Hey, happen to know how the hell I can walk on that water? Naturally, I know. Since time immemorial have I dwelt in solitude on this shore, and I can testify to the extraordinary nature of the lake. What's so extraordinary about it? I mean, besides the fact that you can walk on its surface. A sword, most wondrous, lies in its depths. I watch over it. The blade may be grasped solely by one who possesses the five chivalric virtues. Folk call me a lot of things, but virtuous? I don't know. Yet I do know, for I know who you are. You have proven yourself capable of great sympathy. You are a man of honor, as many can attest. Of humble means yourself. You show generosity to others. Your valor is the stuff of legends. Reason guides your actions, as it does those of all who are wise. You have proven the five chivalric virtues dwell in your heart. Mean the sword's mine? I can dive in and take it? The sword deserves the hand of a master. You must prove your skills are worthy through combat atop the water's surface. Are you ready? Any time. Then draw your blade. One of your enemies cannot be shot or with an old gold, eh? You have proven worthy of wielding the blade, beyond all doubt. Behold! Your Arendite. We've met before. Certainly. The Hermit admitted he knew you, remember? The Lady of the Lake. It is I. Forget not that you are a man right and honorable, devoted to doing good. And for these reasons you received the blade. Now bear it. And I trust this time you shall not lose it. Just wonderful. 